Hello everyone, welcome back to Spectrum Classes. In this video, we are going to synthesize aspirin drug by using the salicylic acid and acetic acid. Since acetic anhydride is banned, so I have applied to purchase that, but in between, I have to perform this experiment with by using acetic acid. So I have taken 2 grams of salicylic acid and transferred it into the round bottom flask. To this salicylic acid, we are going to add acetic acid 15 ml. Here you can see. So I am going to add this acetic acid 15 ml in the salicylic acid which I have already taken. 2 grams in the round bottom. I shake it thoroughly to dissolve it. Here you can see I am shaking it vigorously just to dissolve the salicylic acid into the acetic acid. So here you can see some undissolved part is there. So with the help of glass root, I will try to dissolve it again. So in this way, by using this glass root, I have dissolved all the salicylic acid into the acetic acid. Now to this, we are going to add 4 drops of sulfuric acid. So, 4 drops I have added of sulfuric acid to this mixture of salicylic acid and acetic acid. Now, on adding this sulfuric acid, I again shake it just to mix thoroughly and now we are putting it in the water bath. The temperature of the water bath has been set at 60 degrees centigrade. You can see the green one. So 60.7 degrees centigrade and the current temperature is 36.3. Here you can see in the water bath, the temperature it shows 34.4 degrees centigrade and now it is 36.6 degrees centigrade. It is increasing actually. When it reaches to the 60, inside the water bath, we can see 58 to 59 degrees centigrade. And at this temperature, we leave it for 10 minutes. After removing it from the water bath and cooling up to room temperature, I am going to add 20 ml of distilled water to this mixture. After some time, we get this kind of beautiful crystals in this reaction mixture. So you can see needle shaped crystals. I have also tried this same mixture two times but in the second set of mixture I get different results that I will show you later on. So in the first set I will get this kind of beautiful crystals of aspirin. After some time, we are just going to filter it and wash it using the deionized water just to remove the acid part from this. So here is the filter and from this filter I am going to filter this reaction mixture which is having crystals.
after washing these crystals they looks like this and after leaving it for some time so that they slightly dried they seems like this and we are going to transfer it into the petri dish so they looks like this in the second set i am just having after removing it from the water bath it looks like this and on at, at room temperature when i add distilled water to this we get white precipitates and they are crystalline actually so we left that and these crystals are soluble in methanol so i dissolved all the after filtration i dissolved all the crystals into the methanol and filter it and leave it at room temperature and i again get similar kind of crystals from this set also so if you get either kind of product you need not to worry and uh, let me tell you this is for the laboratory purpose only practical purpose this is not for the experiment of or project work as i have not checked the purity of the product right so this is only for practical purpose